Hi everyone, good day. It's me again, Jerol Sibala, and welcome back to my channel. And today, because I want my channel to be giving some ad added value to my subscribers, and because it's my goal to help every one of you, so today we'll continue with our discussion in relation to how you can manage your finances. And as a financial consultant and as a an educator of financial literacy or financial education, um, I think I it's my obligation, responsibility to at least inform everyone about financial management. And personally, I still believe in real estate business because um, because of the uh, astounding return of investment or ROI. But um, it's also good that we explore um, stocks and tra tra or trading stocks. And if you can vividly recall, in in our first video I introduced to you COL Financial and I shared with you the requirements in opening um, an account um, and right now allow me to share with you um, what we will do once we were, ab were successfully able to open an account so I'm gonna show you how the dashboard or the, or the platform looks looks like um, so I think we're all ready to start but again let me say my disclaimer that I am, I am in no way um, a ma the master in terms of trading and because I'm still working on my masterpiece but at least I'll be walking you through and showing you um, what I'm currently doing to um, to take advantage of trading stocks and the ROI so let's get to know more this time I'm gonna walk you through how the dashboard or the platform looks like so let's do it in three two one Hi everyone, good day and um, allow me to share with you um, how the platform of uh, COL Financial looks like. Um, before I share with you how the platform, I would like to thank um, those who watched my previous video. Um, a lot of people asked me about how they can enjoy um, the dividend and how they can enjoy the capital gains. and, and and stocks appreciation um, so we'll discuss that in the coming in the coming days but but um, thank you very much for your interest in investing to stocks and I think you have done a favor for yourself and that is to you know explore and to discover the, the beauty and the exciting world of stocks and investments um, so um, I hope that you have already opened an account in COL financial and today I'm gonna walk you through um, how the platform looks like or how the dashboard looks like but let me say my disclaimer first and foremost that I am uh, in no way an expert in terms of stocks and I'm also learning the process and what I'm doing right now is just sharing with you what I know about um, uh, stocks investments and uh, let's do it all together so w basically we are learning together uh, in the process and I'm sharing with you what I learned about um, about COL financial and stocks so I'm gonna walk you through now uh, how you are going to uh, or how the COL financial dashboard looks like so once you're done uh, sending all the requirements and um, opening an account so what you need to do is, or you're gonna be provided with a an eight-digit user ID and and then um, your password and this is where you put in your ID so mine for example so we're gonna put it now in now um, so we're gonna log in and so what I'm gonna put emphasis on are the things that you need to know about the dashboard um, so this is basic and probably in the future when we'll be discovering something new then I'll share with that with everyone so this is how the dashboard looks like and some of the things that you need to know are the following so obviously you have the quick links over here. So if you click quick links, um, you're gonna be provided with some quick links here. Um, so for example, you're gonna order, so you can click order. So I'm gonna try to click that. And um, it's Saturday and we cannot place an order because the, the market is closed. But once it's open, then you can start um, ordering some of the stocks. Or you can, ordering means you're gonna buy or you're gonna sell some of your stocks, all right? So we're gonna go back to the home page. And again, this is how the um, dashboard looks like. So there's an announcement here, um, or there are some announcements. That, for example, uh, one of the announcement one of the announcements is uh, PH Resorts Group Holdings Incorporated or PHRR. They are follow-on offering that they are FOO. Actually, what I heard about it is um, they are going to um, offer IPO. I think that is sometime in November if I'm not mistaken that's in November 5 so that's something to look forward to um, so 
uh, please do watch out for that but um, in the home page you are gonna look at some of the latest research you can look at the latest research here and you can um, read through the uh, the article so you'd be guided as well with how you are investing stocks and then there is also col announcement the pse news so all these are very helpful and once you're logged in you can see your user user um, id uh, number your account which is actually the same or in this page you can see uh, the stocks here the most ac active stocks by value so looking at the um, the screen it looks like ali has the most active value for uh, within the given um, uh, within a given within a day so if you take a look at that what's ALI if you, if you click that to know more that's ALI is Ayala land and um, so we're gonna click back you just can you can just click the link here like SMPH you want to know what SMPH is so that is SM prime holding you want to know what uh, FM obviously um, if you or, sorry, I think I, so if you click FM you want to know what FM is so that is SM Investment Corporation. And then we have JFC, JFC is Jo Jollibee Food Corporation, and so on. Right. So meaning in the entire um, transaction day, they are the they are the companies that have the most or these are the companies that have the most active stocks by value. So for example, ang ALI, um the value the value for the given transaction is um over six hundred and seventy six million. Followed by SMPH, um, and then we have the pure gold. So what's next? So we have the last. So for, for example, we're gonna take a look at JFC, ha, to know more about JFC. Because when we are doing stocks, normally an example that we're giving, uh, that we're looking at is JFC. So JFC, for example, we wanna know JFC. So you type JFC here, and then you click quote to know more about JFC. So we're gonna take a look at JFC. So, ang JFC's bid price is 178.50, so 178 pesos and 50 cents. That is a bid price. So, for example, if you're selling your stocks, your Jollibee stocks, you can sell it as as um as low as 178.20 or as as high as uh, 178.50. Pero ikaw, if you have not um, invested in Jollibee yet, or if you are planning to buy more stock, ang offer price niya is 179 pesos. Uh, that's how you're gonna buy it at so 179 pesos um you look at the uh it started within the given trading day at 172 pesos yun ang opening price niya and then ang low niya is 179 171.90 so meaning it can go low within the given trading day at uh, 171.90 pero ang, all, uh, ang high uh we, we call it intraday low and intraday high Yung intraday high niya is 179 pesos so it can go um so yun ang ano uh, high, highest value for the uh, for the given uh transaction day or trading day yun so you watch out for the opening amount the the intraday low and the intraday high you you look into that all right and then um ako personally what i'm looking at when i'm tra when i'm investing or if you are into active trading you look at the losers for the given day kasi most often than not Pag loser kasi, um, after a couple of uh, a couple of hours or a couple of days, it, they, they're going to recover. So looking at the example today, ang, ang, ang top losers natin are, are the following. AR at nine, negative 9.9%. Um, you want to know more about AR? What's AR? This is Abra Mining and Industrial Corporation. Okay, so we, so we, click, we click back. And then, um, so we're going to the top losers. So we have IPM, DWC, and so on. Okay. And then, um, you also have to look into the gainers. You know, the gainers natin. So we have FEU at 12.8, um, LTG, PH, PHA. Ito yung mga, uh, mga top gainers for the trading uh, period. Okay. And then, you want to know more about the markets. Um, actually, ang pinaka-importante talaga for me would be the losers tab the actives and the gainers tab and if you want to be guided as well you can look into research you click research and then you look for uh, this one this is very important cooling the shots so you click this to know more and then they're gonna be recommending kasi, like for example 
um, ano ba yung pinakalatest dito? As of October 1, 2020, you click that. And then, um, there gonna, there's an article that you have to look into. But um, you can you can review whatever is in here, but it looks like they're rec what are they recommending? So we're gonna identify ano yung nire-recommend ni COL. If you scroll down, eto, month on month, so for example, dito, um, um, so, tignan natin kung ano yung mga recommend For example, ito. So, ito yung recommend niya. Uh, so, they recommend, for example, um, pure gold. So, you look at the price at 49, pero you're gonna buy if it's below 47.30. Pero, tignan natin si pure gold. For, so, again, um, ang price niya is 49 as of this writing. Um, future value niya we're uh, or FV niya is at 54.50 but we should not buy stocks that if, if it's beyond 47.30 uh, so you have to buy if it's below 47.30 so we look at pure gold now so for take note ha, yung um, amount that we should not buy if it's if the stock price is above 47.30 so let's take a look at pure gold so back tayo we're gonna go back to the home page. Um, so, si Pure Gold, uh, ang code kasi niya, P Gold ata, if I'm not mistaken. Um, so, we're gonna look at Pure Gold. Oh, for, it's 42.50. So, it's good to buy stocks right now of Pure Gold. Um, actually, ang Pure Gold, uh, parang, there, pag red kasi dito, that means they're losing, di ba? May, may, ano, may, they're losing negative 58%. So, it's good to buy pure gold stock as of the moment. Um, ang, I, I think the stocks now are starting to recover. Lumi, as they say, lumilipad na yung stocks after pandemic. Um, Jollibee right now, for example, is now at 179 pesos. Ganun. And lastly, if you want to know more about your investment you want to see how your investment has performed so you can click trade and then you can this is where you can enter order you're going to modify your order um you want to see your trading history and of course your port, uh, portfolio so you click portfolio para you can see um yung performance ng i mean how are your or how's your account look like or how, how does your account look like so you click the port portfolio so in my example um so, ito yung mga investments ko. I'm just gonna co cover this later on. But, um, so far, looking at my um, investments, so I have invested in BDO, um, BPI, Century Pacific, or CN, Century Pacific Food Incorporated, Dito CME, uh, GMA Network, All Home Corporation, Security Bank Corporation. So, you notice, may mga nag-green na um, since I've started a couple of days ago. So, it's it has started to recover. Um... But you have to, you know, time is your best friend and time is your best enemy in terms of stocks and trading. But ako personally, I'm more into long-term investment. So if it's uh, showing red right now, I, I don't worry because eventually it will just bounce back. And um, very excited because there are actually two ways now how you can earn uh, money in stocks. So number one is uh, through dividends. So I'm very excited for my dividends. And secondly, it is through capital gains or stocks appreciation. So for example, you bought it... Um, for example, yung BPI ko, I bought it at around 68. If you take a look at it, yung market price niya ngayon is now at 74.40. So meaning, through the days that I have started investing in BPI, uh, I have gained, uh, what, around 6 pesos per stock. So I think I I, I am on the right track in terms of um, investing BPI. Kasi lahat ngayon bumabawi na. Everything is starting to get back to normal after the pandemic. So I think now is the perfect time to you know invest and to um, venture into stocks. So I hope that you learned something today, especially about the dashboard. And I will see you in our next vlog. I can't wait to see you and we'll discuss more about how we can earn money, how we can learn more about stocks para uh, we can, you know, we can prosper all together. So I'll see you in my next vlog. Thank you very much. Have a good day. Bye. Yeah.